a guy in Quebec actually said their head medical personnel actually said that the restrictions could become permanent. I'm going to see if I can find that restrictions could become permanent Quebec. Cause this is pretty insane thing to say. I think he's the first person to say that. Uh, there we go. Westphalian times. I've met these people a couple of times. Not a very big website, but they do their due diligence. Quebec's public health director says measures in place could become permanent. Horatio Arruda, Quebec's public health director, refused to exclude the possibility that current measures in place could become permanent. Um, yeah, I, th I think I met this guy. I'm not sure. When asked by a journalist from Journal de Montreal when the COVID measures would be lifted, Horatio Arruda refused to exclude it. That's what the title was. Mandatory masks, limits on private gatherings, quarantine, vaccination in some industries, mandatory vaccination to go to restaurants and attend any non-essential social activities, which is crazy. So he also, I remember reading this the other day, um, everybody, of course, used to talk about like 60 or 70% was the benchmark we wanted to get for vaccines. He, they, they mentioned 95% um, in this last uh, <laughs> in this last press conference. He, he said, you shouldn't be surprised. Something like, don't be surprised if we're going up for 95% or like that's something more realistic that we're going for now. So COVID zero is obviously a very stupid, stupid plan to get. But it it's insane because even in New York and California, they literally, quite literally, celebrated the quote unquote 70% benchmark. Like they opened Disneyland and yay, like we'll go to Disneyland and, and they had fireworks in the city in, in New York. And it's like, wait, so six weeks ago, you were celebrating this monumental uh, injection rate or whatever. And now you're saying, no, it doesn't matter. Put the mask back on. Lockdowns are coming again. You, you can't go eat. Like they're literally telling people they can't go work out unless they get the shot. Like it's beyond me, but here we are. This is 1984, I guess.